point, and actually Democratic Congressman Chris Pappas issued a statement to the effect that this plan regarding college debt doesn't address the underlying cost of college. So kind of honing in on a question that my colleagues have asked, is the president ready to do more when it comes to addressing the underlying and ever-increasing cost of college? Is he willing to work with Congress? Is this something he's going to address more in the future? Well, he's talked about uh, he's talked about that in the past, right? He's talked about what he's he wants to make sure that uh, we lower cost, right, uh, uh, of college uh, for uh, for students. Look, since 1980, the total cost of both four-year public and four-year private college has nearly tripled, uh, even after accounting for inflation. Federal support has not kept up. Uh, Pell Grants once covered nearly 80 percent of the cost of a four-year public college degree for students from working families, but now only covered a third. The typical undergraduate student with loans now graduates with nearly $25,000 in debt. And so this is something that is going to help deal with that specific issue. Look, the president has done, has done, has taken multiple actions. We're looking at today's actions, but if you think about uh, the $32 billion that he was uh, able to do to give debt relief to more than 1.6 million uh, borrowers, that is something that he has done in his this administration. That is historic. Uh, that was a historic effort. Uh, this is part of it. With the pa if you think about the pause, how much that has saved uh, Americans who have not been, who have not had to pay a dollar. You've heard that from his speech today of of uh, of repayment since uh, since he's got into office which started before uh, this president this president just continued uh, the the efforts so that matters that is also important so we just want to make sure that is clear as well uh, you know this is this is going to help uh, millions and millions of people uh, who who you know you think about the Pell grant that was discussed a moment ago you can get if you if you have a, a recipient of the Pell grant and you are or a borrow, borrow, of course, you can, that goes up to $20,000. And that matters because people who are on the Pell Grant, uh, they come from households that make less than $60,000. That matters. Half of that are folks in house, household that makes less than 30000 So all of the, these efforts are going to, uh, to matter. They're going to have an effect. Uh, and what you heard from my colleagues who were just here moments ago, uh, they're going to encourage people to take, to take that, to take this opportunity uh, to help them with those efforts. I'm going to I'm just going to move around. I'm just going to move around. 